Yes. Okay, papito. That's a good happen, you guys, okay? <laughs> it's the it's the froggy algo. Yes, mamita. Tan bella. You guys enjoying the story? Oh. Okay. Mamita, bang, 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 bang. Come on in. Come on in. Oh my goodness. Mira, pero mira como si grande están acá. Come already. Wow. My grand boy, my grand girl. Come on in. Yeah, yeah. Give me him. Let me see. Wow. His sleeve? Bang. That my good. Ay, papito. Ay, mira, pero qué precioso. Oh, my goodness. Uh, all right, you go to sleep, okay? You go to sleep. You you sit down there, okay, mamita? You sit down. You and your brother, you guys, I hear you guys been very good. Uh-huh. You been a good big sister, right? Hermanita, hermanita, bonita, ¿verdad? Qué bueno, qué bueno. Okay, papito, okay. See, you see, you see right there, okay? Mamita, you sit there, and today I'm going to talk about the Prince Rabbit, okay? Huh? Oh, ribbit. <laughs> ribbit. ¿Pero qué es un ribbit? Ribbit. Oh, like the frog of ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> ribbit. Ay, pero ¿qué? esta palabra, ribbit. Okay, okay. The Prince Ribbit, ok, 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 vamos a ver, vamos a ver, así, so, The Prince Ribbit, papito, papito, ok, The Prince Ribbit, déjame ver, ok, The Princess, papito, you, you're gonna have to sit over there in order to see, ok, you're not gonna be able to see, mamita, can you hold your brother? You take, you take, oh, okay, you sit down over there. Okay, you, okay, you sit down nicely, okay? We're gonna read this book, The Prince Ribbit, okay? Okay, Prince Ribbit. Let's see. It's a nice, nice book. Uh, oh, and it says on the back, just because it's in a book doesn't mean it's true. Just because it's in a book doesn't mean it's true. Okay. Okay, it's a fairy tale, so they're not true. Okay, okay, mamita, papito. Okay, vamos, vamos. The princess and frog prince got married and live happily ever after. For a princess Aravella. Closing the book with a satisfied sigh. <sighs> she looks very satisfied. Satisfied sigh right there, okay? Princess Lucinda frowned. That silly girl treated the frog so badly, she say. She was lucky he married her. If I ever met a talking frog, I would not make the same mistake. That's what she said. That's her. Right there, they're talking over there about this book. Okay. But Princess Marta rolled her eyes. She's like, ugh. She liked facts more than fairy tales and real frogs more than enchanted ones. She's heard a real frog croaking in the royal pond many times, but never could spot that frog. He's a clever little thing, she said. She'd be looking for, for some frogs so she can kiss a prince, I guess, and become happily ever after. <laughs> okay. But Marta, Marta, Marta was right. The frog was very clever. Indeed, he often listened on the sisters' stories and more he heard of princes and princesses, the more he longed to believe like them. So here's, here's the, the frog, and he's listening to the stories, and he's very elusive, and you can't find him very much. But the frog, it says down here, it dreamed of sleeping in a soft bed, eating fine foods, wearing beautiful crown, and he just come up with a cunning plan to make his dreams come true. Ooh, I like that, very ambitious. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah. Ah, yes, mamita, hace un poco de café con leche. Uh -huh. Vamos, vamos, seguir. Eee, yuck. Go away, you slimy little beast. Shriek out of ella. 
in Lucinda is the frogs hopped in front of them. There he goes. He's he's hopping, hopping. Hey, hello, my baby. <laughs> but the frog did not go away. Instead, he cleared his throat and spoke. <coughs> You guys enjoying the story? Oh. Okay. I got that. No. Your mama gonna be home later, okay? She's, she'll be home. She'll be back. She went to go do some chores. Okay, okay. Let's read the book a little bit more, okay? All right, papito. Allow me to introduce myself, said the sly frog. My name is Prince Ribbit. Look at him, Ribbit, Ribbit, the Ribbit Prince, the Ribbit Prince, the Ribbit Prince. <laughs> Arabella and Lucinda stared, open-mouthed, but Marta was delighted. It's a frog, she shouted, a talking frog. Yes, it's exciting, right? Very good. Let's see what, see what happens to the frog. Let's see what happens to the frog. Actually, I'm an enchanted prince, the frog said. A jealous wizard turned me into a frog because I was so astonishingly handsome. And only if there was a way to break the spell. See, this frog is very smart, very smart. He'd been listening to the stories, and now he made himself into the story and hoping that maybe they kiss him, maybe they, 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 they take him and give him housing, maybe they take care of him. <laughs> but there is, cried Lucinda. It's in this book. You just need to be looked after by a pretty princess like me. <laughs> Pero que, que inteligente este muchacho, este ribi, ¿verdad? Este frog. <laughs> okay. A pretty princess like me, Sarah Bella. And then you turn back into your old, handsome, astonishing, 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 very handsome, very handsome self. And we can live happily ever after. Uh -huh. Look at the front. Así es, así es. Eso es la vida, ¿verdad? <laughs> Lucinda and Arabella took Prince Ribi back to the palace and gave him whatever he wanted. Mírale, mírale. I mean, just siesta time. Lucinda let him sleep on her pillow. Arabella let him eat from her plate. Comiendo bien, guy. He's eating good. Look at this stomach with it. <laughs> Filled up. Uh -huh. But the more Princess Marta saw the frog, the more suspicious she became. Why are you making such a fuss of him, she asked, as Prince Ribbit hopped around at the dinner table. Mira, like hopping around, oh, eating over here, eating over there, comiendo esto, comiendo eso. Uh, por todo lado. Because he's an enchanted prince, said Arabella. And that's how you break the spell. Yeah, it's in the book. It's, it's got to be true. It's in the book, right? But just because it's in the book, <laughs> it doesn't mean it's true. Mm -hmm. And with that, she went to the Royal Library to look up the truth about frogs. So she went to the Royal Library. Do your research. Do your research, people. Mm -hmm. A mother frog lays eggs, she explained to her sister, then the egg turns into tadpoles, and then the tadpoles turn into frogs, but frogs don't ever turn into prince. That's science. But it was, uh, yeah, science? What are you going to do with science, huh? Just because it's in a book doesn't mean it's true, replied her sisters. Oh, they're using the same thing. You see that? You see that? So Lozinda and Arabella continue to pamper Prince Rivet. They let him sleep in the biggest, softest bed. Uh huh. And gave him the nice, finest clothing and a beautiful new crown. You see, what he did was manifest his. Uh, 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 he saw his dreams. He went after it. He said it, and he did it. Wow. A mí me gusta este este frog, este frog, este frog. Vamos, vamos, vamos a ver. Marta was the only person who saw Prince Rivet for what he really was. And she was very suspicious, and she knew exactly what was going on. He was taking advantage of him. But hey, you may be clever, but you're just an ordinary frog, she said. But you know, don't let the haters 
call you ordinary. Hey, this guy is extraordinary to me. He saw his dream, he saw his opportunity, and he went for it. Hey, that's extraordinary for me. But hey, hey, that's just my, uh, mi opinion, verdad? But just because it's in the book doesn't mean it's true, said the frog. Everybody say this. This one say it, this one say it, y el otro say it too. Hey, pero que, que, que se yo, que se yo, que se yo. Anyway, um, this is hopeless, start mother time. My sisters will never believe me, no matter what and how many books and facts I show them, but I suppose they're just stubborn. I've never read their storybooks. Maybe I should read their storybooks. So Martha gathered a pile of fairy tales and began to read. And she's reading. Look at her. She's doing a good job reading, reading, reading. Are you guys reading? You guys need to be reading. Uh -huh. Books, not just looks, okay? Books, not just looks. Uh huh. Es un que que yo ahora mismo I said it right now. <laughs> That's my saying. Okay. She was surprised to find that while the stories might not be true, they were often funny, exciting, and inspiring. Mm -hmm. And after Marta had read them all, she knew exactly what to do with the Prince Ribbit. Is she going to kiss him? Mm -hmm. Come here, Ribbit Rabbit. Ribbit Frog. <laughs> rabbit. I don't know. I don't know. If you're really an enchanted prince, why hasn't the spell been broken yet, she said. Marta asked Prince Ribbit the next morning. Hmm. Prince Ribbit shifted uneasily in his little golden throne and adjusted his golden crown. Perhaps, listen to his excuse, perhaps it's because I have not been treated well enough. Intelligent, <laughs> verdad? He's a very smart one, huh? huh? Maybe I need more. Maybe you need to do more for me. Maybe you need to do more for me. Hmm. You seem very well treated to me, said Marta. I think it's time to try something different. What's the one thing that will always break an evil spell? Hmm. The true love kiss, cried Arabella and Lucinda. The true love kiss. It breaks every spell, they say. Me first. Oh, look. <laughs> it's the frog. It's the frog. It's the frog. It's the frog. Me first, Arabella, planting a big, wet smacker on Prince Ribbit's clammy cheek. Me, dale, me, dale. He's like, uh, uh. <laughs> You don't love him as much as I do, said Prince Lucinda, snatching the frog from her sister and squashing his face in a passionate <laughs> kiss. But no matter how many kisses they gave him, and look, un besito aquí, un besito aquí, un besito aquí, un besito. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. You guys watch the book, okay? Okay, I just love, I love you, I love you. I love you, yo te quiero, papito, mamita. Yeah, Grandpa loves you, okay? Grandpa loves you. Well, okay, the story. But no matter how many kisses they give him, Prince Ribbit remained very much a frog, and in the end, both princesses realized that this was all he'd ever be. All he'd ever be. But the frog said, don't limit me. You don't know, you don't know. Don't squash my dreams. <laughs> it's, a, it's the frog. I suppose I should go back to my pond, sighed the frog, taking off his beautiful crown. But he looked so sad that Marta couldn't help feeling sorry for him. Look at him. He's ready to pack his bags and go. Pero, papito, papito, you, you, you got you to gotta stay. You got to stay strong. Ah, yeah. Please don't go, she said. Ah. Any animal smart enough to fool my sisters would be fun to have around. And while I might not want a handsome prince as a husband, I'd love to have a clever frog as a friend. Que bonito. Amigos, amigos, amigos. She picked up the frog and she gave him a gentle kiss. Pero mira esto. Pero the instant that Marta kissed 
him, a huge puff of pink smoke appeared and the frog turned into a handsome young prince. Pero mira esto. Yes, mamita. It happened. In fact, he was so handsome that Marta decided that she did not want to marry him at all. Huh? So she fell into his arms and they both... Oh, that she did want to marry him. I'm sorry. She did want to marry him after all. And they both live happily ever after. And once again, oh, just because it's in a book does not mean it's true. Ah, that was a good story, right? Te gusto? Did you like it? <laughs> well, good, good, good. I'm so glad your mom brought you guys here today. I'm so glad to see you and spend time with you again. Will you guys come back tomorrow? Will you then, we'll do another story? I'll give you some candy. Don't tell your mama, okay? I got you. Oh, will you come back tomorrow? I'll tell you another story, okay? You tell, you tell your mama to bring you back tomorrow, okay? Come here, puppy. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Ah, oh, yes. Okay, puppy. That's so good having you guys, okay? I love you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? We tell another story then, okay? Okay, I love you, Papito. Bye-bye.